Welcome back YouTube, VST here, Veran Speaks Tech. Let me show you something. Boom, nothing. Twitter account, download the Nothing Launcher Beta to preview the unified graphics and key features of Nothing OS. Available on the Google Play Store for the Samsung S21, S22, the Google Pixel 5 and 6 series and OnePlus coming soon. You probably know already why I'm so excited. If you have been a frequent viewer of my channel, I was really in love with OnePlus devices. I actually did a lot of OnePlus videos, Oxygen OS reviews, the Oxygen OS battery reviews, the Google Camera reviews, until, yeah, you know, all the recent events and the unification between OnePlus and Oppo, etc. And I'm not saying that's something bad because of course Oppo is or were or are the more premium phones and etc. But I kind of feel sad the way I had to part my relation kind of ties with OnePlus. So you probably know Carpe left the company, he started nothing and actually they created their first product. This is the so-called nothing ear, right? It's actually a pair of headphones, you know, and I'm using those headphones guys right now on a regular basis, right? And I prefer those one versus this one and yeah right you know that, that's a whole other story guys so a while ago carl announced that they've been working on something new and now of course there are a lot of rumors it might be a phone it might not be a phone etc it might be just an os it might be just a launcher but hey it is available right now as a launcher so get a first taste of nothing os with the nothing launcher they're very excited that's the first iteration of the nothing os your first taste of a phone. Okay, I mean, I'm really thrilled and that's why I'm making this video. Max icons and Max folders, a new experience for Android. Wow, I mean, come on. Hold and press to enlarge app folders or individual apps so the things you use the most are most visible. That's kind of an interesting idea, but I'm really doubtful right now if it's something new because we've seen so many launches, right? I mean, an Android, right? Unlimited options. Launch any app directly from your folders. This doesn't really sound and probably even look something new but yeah bespoke cloak and weather widgets raw tech balanced by human warmth you know yeah i i have to give it those guys they really have a nice marketing or probably i'm just dumb enough to fall for these things but i would really like this like raw tech balanced by human warmth yeah in 99 percent all these things are just you know some nice things set on a PowerPoint slide or on a web page, and the reality is a bit different. These widgets use the same dot matrix font as our logo, which is actually this one here. This dot matrix font is also present here in the headphones. Nothing wallpaper in style. Update your home screen with the Nothing wallpaper and matching color palette. There's also bonus content that you can download there, right? Two more exclusive wallpapers, ringtones, how you can get it. So just click on the Google Play Store and boom, Nothing Launcher. Here it is, guys. Now let's just press the install button. And yep, without any further ado, I am going to set up the Nothing Launcher only four megabytes, by the way. Jesus, I'm now interrupting myself. So excited I am. Maybe I'm overexcited, but yeah, let's see, guys. Only four megabytes. So honestly, right now, I don't expect any miracles right now. I'm going to set it up as my default launcher and let's together check this experience. Boom. Here it is, guys. So how do we do this on in Samsung phones, guys? Click on the settings, click here the search button. Then you can just search for something called default apps. Choose default apps, guys. When you click it, then, yep, home app right now is the One UI. Nothing launcher, guys, for the first time. Yep, okay. For the first time on my phone, um, yeah. Okay, I can still access my quick settings, guys. So apparently, nothing launcher for the first time on my Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra, the Exynos version. Okay, now let's see what we can do, by the way. Let me just try to hold here. Oh, wow, this looks so familiar, guys. This looks like, yeah, the stock Android launcher, Android 13. Okay, so home settings. Oh, okay, this nice dot matrix phone here. Notification dots. Notification access needed. Okay, so I'm going to give the Nothing Launcher notification access so it's on. Add application icons to the home screen for new apps. Okay, on and off. And then we have the About, the Nothing Launcher version 011. Okay, so not a lot of home settings, but yeah, that's just like a preview, like a beta. Let's go to wallpaper and styles. Wallpaper and styles, select the new wallpaper. We have the scrolling one, we have the app grid, and then you have the app icon. It's either like the nothing icon, 
Okay, ah, that's the icon pack. Or you can just choose whatever else you have. Um, what can I say, guys? This is really just, yeah, not a lot, right? But I'll just say probably because it's a better version. So it really looks like not the full thing, not the final product. And yeah, let's see. They bragged about the widgets. Let's just see what we have here. Useful info at your fingertips. To get info without opening apps, you can add widgets to your home screen. All right. Do I have, oh, nothing launcher, three widgets, guys. We have the clock one, and then another clock one, and then the weather one. Let's add the uh, weather one, okay. Yep, let's add uh, the weather one. Okay, I'm going to now give permission. All right. Uh, so what are the options here? Temperature units in Celsius, current location. And yes, okay, yeah. We can make it bigger, I guess. But you know what, guys? I have to be honest with you. This is not really my style. Yeah, okay, let's just see what other options do we have. So what happens when, let's say, I press it, I have here, hmm, I have to press it, and then widget settings, no, one more time, and like this, or what? Okay, yes, it's not even very useful, by the way, because if you want to click, and then the menu is gone, so, all right, you know what, I'm going to remove, I'm going to remove this widget, okay, and let me just add the, the clock one. So this is not really my thing. I'm even not able to remove it. Just bear a moment. Okay, now I managed to remove it. Item removed. Hold on again. Then let's go to widgets. Let's get down to where we have the Nodding Launcher. And let's get this clock. Okay, let's get this one. Because I think it's clear I'm not a big fan of this dot matrix font, whatever. Okay, so what settings do we have? All right, oh, okay, yeah, no settings at all. All right, let's just check also the wallpapers, guys. So wallpaper and styles, select a new wallpaper, mm, explore more wallpapers, it's just gonna open some galaxy themes and etc. Okay, let's just check the app drawer. Yeah, the font is, by the way, nice, it's kind of bold, so yeah, not not so bad, I would say. So let's let's now just, just create a new folder, guys. Oh, I'm gonna add here Telegram, all right. And let's try to also add Twitter, okay? Let's add it there. Now, first thing I wanna do, guys, I wanna hold my finger on the icon to just see what they can do here. All right, it's nice, I have access to widgets. Oh, huh, yeah, they were not kidding. You really can make a big icon. Okay, same here, by the way. Boom, now two big icons, yep. I will never have problems using this phone, no matter how bad my eyes are, because boom, these big icons. All right, let's make them small again. Let's make them s s small again. Now, let's see what more information can we get. So, what is this? Yeah, this was just a delete one. Okay, not so, I would say, user-friendly, but, you know, I mean, this is nothing uh, launcher. Like, yeah, you need to be clever to use it. So, let's hold here the finger. Let's press information. Yeah, just get the standard stuff. So, while I'm holding here the finger, I can get access to some of um, the guys that I'm chatting with and also some of the widgets that are really up related now what i'm going to do guys i'm going to hold a twitter and put it there so now i have created a folder which i'm going to call social all right okay so what will happen right now so let's say i'm using telegram so much by the way you can subscribe to system hacks he's a very good friend of mine he creates very nice videos where is the recent menu by the way so let's say i've opened telegram and i've opened twitter um okay but yeah, yeah, now I think I got it. So you have to do it. How did I do it? So I think I found a way on how to use the recent menu. I cannot do it somehow from the home screen, but let's say if I'm gonna open Telegram, then from here I'm able to do it. And by the way, I think this is the very standard recent menu that we have from the One UI, right? So this is not really, yeah, something related to this launcher. Now, those are the animations. All right, let's just, where is my camera, guys? Now, camera opening, all right, camera closing, opening. Closing, opening. I want to check the animations somehow. They're not bad, by the way. Animations are thing are quite okay. See here. Play Store, opening, closing, opening, closing. Yeah. Okay, now the interesting stories. Let me just try to group them one more time. Can I make this folder also go crazy big, like hold the finger there? Ah, enlarge. <laughs> okay. Yep. Yep. I think I have game right now with the nothing launcher guys i think this is it 
For a first, I would say like alpha version, it's not that bad. I still miss some things, right? I cannot access, you know, my Google feed. And by the way, you just can see it for yourselves. There aren't really a lot of settings. I just think that they will start building up based on this foundation. And I'm really happy that I was able to give you this sneak preview, guys. If you have liked this video, don't forget to really like the video, subscribe for the channel, guys. Please you and your family stay safe. I'm now gonna minimize the folder, guys, and quit. Bye. VST over and bye.